after a number of reports criticize the CDC's response to the coronavirus pandemic, lawmakers are getting answers from the agency's director. As Morgan Wright reports, they want to know if the CDC dropped the ball on testing, data collection, and more. Centers for Disease Control Director Dr. Robert Redfield warned lawmakers the coronavirus is no less contagious and he shares their concerns about the spread of the virus as states reopen. This is the Lake of Ozarks. Is the CDC tracing everyone who was there? Can't answer for the state. We are building enhanced capacity across this country to do contact tracing. Connecticut Congresswoman Rosa DeLauro says the health and safety of Americans has not been a top federal priority, especially since the focus has shifted to restarting the economy. Over 20,000 new cases, over 1,000 deaths. We do not have testing, tracing resources that we need to prevent more deaths. Deloro says the federal response has been inconsistent at best. The U.S. has had the worst response to coronavirus of any country in the world. In America, we always tend to think we're either the best or the worst at everything. Oklahoma Congressman Tom Cole argues we're no worse off than other nations, but he questioned Redfield on how to better prepare for future pandemics. What kind of investments we need to make going forward. Redfield told lawmakers they need to spend money now to save lives. You think we weren't prepared for this? We'll wait until we have a real global threat for our health security. Redfield says reliable data is critical to any disease response. He urged Congress to spend money to bring the nation's public health computer systems into the 21st century. In Washington, Morgan Wright, CBS 17 News.